Hello. Uh, Stoke and P. Limo A. Show, 102.7 WNEW. Hi. Who's this? This is Kelly. Hi, Kelly. You're back, Kelly. What do you want? I don't know. This is my first time calling, but I just wanted to talk to Patty to see, Patty, what first attracted you to, to Opie? What, what made you decide to stalk him? I'm not a stalker. All right. You know what? Okay. We're not talking about that right now. Hang up on this bitch. <laughs> Line four, please. Hey, that's not nice. Uh, have a nice night. <laughs> Hello. Stoker P. Limo A. Show. Who's this? Kelly. And I want Patty to answer my question. Oh. Come on. Let Patty talk. Patty, please say something. Just say Patty, you find, just talk, say talk, you talk, find his freckles Opie. nice or something like that. What, are you jealous over there that she has a thing for, for Opie and not for you? I actually long to have Opie, Kelly. <laughs> I dream about him every night, okay? Okay. Let's Hang hear up the you, phone, Patty. you skank. Kelly, I love them both the same. Oh, please. Line for... What do you like about Opie? His eyes, his butt, what? Oh. You're I talking like to me? Both as friends and just the same. I tell that to everybody. Is that right? <laughs> That's right. Okay, so what does Opie have over Anthony that you prefer Opie? But I don't prefer either one. I like them both the same. They're each other their own person. Uh huh. That's how I feel. Kelly. So yes. Can I ask you a question? Yes. Do you know that Allie McBeal is going to adopt? I think she I think already did. I think she's a lesbian. What do you think? I, oh, I don't know. I don't know. I definitely think that about Rosie, but uh, I think she's too skinny to have a child. Yeah. Yeah, she uh, doesn't feed herself. I don't believe she'll feed her children. Okay, back to Patty and Opie. <laughs> All right, you know what? Yeah. Kelly, call back tomorrow. We'll be on at 7 o'clock. Have a nice night. <laughs> Stalker P. Limo A. Show, 102.7 WNEW. Who's this? Hello. Hello, who's this? Yeah, what's up? This is Sumo. Listen, Anthony. Yes, yeah, Sumo. I have a razor to my wrist, and I'm aiming my truck at a crowd of innocent people on Broadway. If you and that other dimrod don't get off the radio now, I'm going to plow them all, I swear. Sumo. We love you, too. I thank you very much. You have a nice night. Thank you for the support. We're going to go to break in about two minutes. Uh, we're going to go to break now, okay? Let's go to break. No, we're going to keep on talking? Oh, call letters. Two uh two one two seven five seven one zero two seven W N E W. We're gonna go to break. Uh, let's uh, listen. These guys are killing me here. Let's talk about the. Um, are we staying on? Are we going to break? I can't. I can't hear. Oh, I think we're going in the middle of spot. All right, this is gonna wrap up this segment of the Stalker P and Limo A show. This, uh, we're gonna go to break, and this fine radio show will be back in a couple of minutes. Yeah. Opie and Anthony are going to follow in about five or ten minutes after the show is over with. <laughs> and, uh, all right, you know what? We're going to wrap up everything we talked about, the Giants. We talked about the Jets. We talked about horoscopes. We talked about me killing myself and uh, that you're a stalker. Yeah. Shut up, dummy. Can we go to break, please? Okay. What do you do? Say the call letters, Stalker Patty. W-N-E-W. Thank you, uh, Stalker DNA Patty. Station. Thank you, Stalker Patty. We, we have to do a live read. Can I do the live read? Sure. That's what they said. we got to go to break. These guys are killing me. It was going flow. You know what? Let's take another phone call, please. We're not going to go to break. I want to take another phone call, please. Hello? Can somebody? All right. You know what, Patty? Might as well talk about something else. Can we go to a phone call? Please? They want to talk about Temptation Island. So Jess, if you're driving in your car, hurry. Please pick me up because uh, my, my life is over with. <laughs> we do traffic reports uh, sponsored by that lovely limousine company on the ONA show, but uh, <laughs> they won't let me do that either. Um, are we going to break, gentlemen, or uh, are we coming back? Are we on? What's Can I take a phone call? Where, like, where would you like to break your leg, your arm? Oh, my, I want to break my life. <laughs> Jamaican Mike, how are you? Come, come here. Oh, no, we can't even have, I can't even have somebody? No. Hi, Jamaican Mike, how are you? Do you like the show? Great show. We're doing good, right? Yeah. How's my car, right? Perfect spot. Thank you. So, uh, so they, said to, they said they want us to go to break. Okay, we so are going to go to break, live. and we're going to give you all listeners a break. Line one? Anybody? Somebody? Am I, are we still on? When you're, when you're telling these little stories, here's a good idea. Have a point. 
We don't have a pool. Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> Quiet. Never fear. Smith is here. You have the stack of two reads so we can read it? Yes. You're supposed to do a live read, sir? Can I have the... Uh, we are going to talk about Stacker 2. The world's... The world's strongest stack burner. Good. This is the new year. Big deal. Just like any other year, you wait until the last minute and then freak because you're fat. Fat. <laughs> Remember fat. last March when it got to the 70s and the old coats and sweaters had to come off? Fat. Just remember how y'all felt all lumpy and you hated putting on something that showed it? It's gonna make you puke! You swore I'd never wait again. Well, Happy New Year! This year's gonna be different, Anthony. How'd you like to shut my ass? Yeah. You, Anthony, are gonna look hot and make people notice you. There you go. Don't just stare at it. G-string, G-string. You can eat what you want, but take stack or two, the world's strongest fat burner bitch. first, and you That's can right, eat. you're a bitch, and I bet the you The world's like strongest fat burner you. first, and you can eat. Just yeah, eat less. Fact, those homemade cookies, that box of chocolates, the fruitcake. First of all, anybody that gives a fruitcake is a gift. <laughs> Did you give any gifts this year? I didn't get a gift from you. Merry Christmas, by the way. Happy Merry Christmas. Christmas. What a live read. But anyway, researchers have come up with a new way, Anthony, to control weight. Can you imagine restraining what you eat and losing weight? No. Or you can take stacker to the world's strongest fat burner. Uh, wrong! Try again, dumbass! Eat what you want, eat less, and still lose weight. That's research that we can prove because people call all the time to tell us how great it works. The facts in 45 minutes. Stack it to the world's strongest fat burner. Call 1 800 Lightline. That's 1 800 Lightline. Or visit the web at stacker2.com. Or visit the crickets. Or visit the crickets of this fine radio show. We're going to wrap it up. I want to thank everybody for listening to the Stalker P and Limo A show. Patty, I'm sorry I took over the whole airwaves. Do you have anything to say? Uh, a nice warm and party. <laughs> Other debauchery on the way. Stay there. 1027. Any man brutal. I got to read a couple really fast. Dan from Westfield. Powered by Opie and Anthony. Owned by Infinity Broadcasting. Decimated by Stalker <laughs> Patty and Limo A. Speaking of traffic, why don't you go stand in some? <laughs> Juan from Long Island. Stalker Patty, the retarded Lynn Samuel. <laughs> John from Jersey. Where the F is that Van Halen song when you need it? <laughs> <laughs> Anthony, Rockaway Betting, 1-800-TRY-A-BED. I'm killing you. Imagine the public listening to this. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Rockaway Betting, over 140 stores throughout New York and New Jersey. All the brand name mattresses, Sealy Posturepedic, Serta Perfect Sleeper, and Simmons Beauty Rest. The price is up to 65% below department store prices. Come see the all-new uh, mattresses at Rockaway Betting, the new Simmons 2000 Beauty Rest. The individual coils for no partner disturbance and a mattress you never need to flip. Plus the latest in luxury bedding from Stearns & Foster, Sealy Posturepita, Crown Jewel, and the lowest prices possible. Rockaway Bedding is the only major area mattress store that offers you a free steel bed frame, free delivery, and free complete removal of that old disgusting bed. Yes, sleep is important. It's a medical fact. The better you <laughs> sleep, the better you feel. <laughs> Uh, someone is begging us to have Stalker Patty do a live read for Horny Goat Weed. <coughs> oh, my God. Yeah, one of those uh, improve your sex life things. Carmine from Jersey. Today I learned that Mason and Kalinske weren't really that bad. <laughs> All right, guys. A mattress is the most important piece of furniture in your house. Uh, a new mattress from Rockaway Bedding will improve your sleep, your energy, and that sex life. Yes. Get a new mattress today. You can go to Rockaway Bedding, one of the stores nearest you, or call them up, 1-800-TRY-A-BED, 1-800-TRY-A-BED for Rockaway Bedding. I talk so fast, I can't make out all the dirty words. What is this? 1027. WNEW. All right, we're back, Anthony. Oh. The o and ship. That was... Something. I think we made radio history there. We do stuff like that to make ourselves feel better. Two one two seven five seven one zero two seven is our phone number. 
We have to go to the phones really fast here, and then we'll move on. We've got uh, Susie from Mississippi on the line to get an update on Stinky's trip to W-O-N-A in Mississippi. Yeah. Uh, Fred, what's going on? Hey, not much, guys. Uh, that was brutal. Yeah. That was absolutely brutal. I think we found a cure for insomnia. I know you guys tape stuff. Yeah. Okay, my, I want to give you my address, so uh, you can send me that tape. It'll uh, put me to sleep at night. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Fred. I thought people enjoyed the uh, Stalker Patty Annoying Anthony show. That's what I thought. Chet, what's going on? Well, I was just going to tell us, guys, if they were to go home tonight and get in the tub and then drag the radio in with them, they'd know how we felt. <laughs> that could be dangerous. What? I thought that went real well. What happened? Yeah, he's crying from this side of the speaker. <laughs> All right, Jeff. <laughs> what happened? Hey, Chris, what's up? I think, uh, I think this is probably the best thing that you guys have done since you came back. Yeah. You like it? Yeah, I think so. All right, there you go. Some guy's saying that Patty's voice made him hot. Really?